Hey there, White TPC. It's your boy Cosmo, Cat Dad Piper. Hope you're having a great day whenever you find this coming to you from a early Monday evening. And just thought I'd start my official beginning of the Codger Challenge 2023. This year it's being set up and established by our friend Pat over at Paladin Piper. If you're not following him or if you missed the challenge rules, which he posted about three days ago, I'll have a link to that video down below in the description. Now, it's been about three days since it started, but I haven't had a pipe since before then, so time to get going on this. It's 30 days, two pipes. One must be briar, the other must be some other material, and one tobacco, either a classic codger blend or something that's available in bulk or pouch. So... Let's go over what I'm going to be doing this month. Starting with the tobacco. We got some Carter Hall here. This is my uh, go-to codger blend. It's great for deghosting a pipe, breaking in a new pipe, or if you want something that's just going to be a crowd pleaser. It's good stuff. Oh, smells fantastic. Haven't had a whole lot of this container or tub of it. This is a 14 and ounce tub. This is my second tub of it to date. And uh, just a really reliable tobacco. Great one to help welcome in the warmer weather. Now, what are the pipes I'm going to be smoking it in? Got two pipes. We'll start with the briar. Classic billiard shape. This is a Savinelli 114. Great size, great feel, great weight. Looks great, smokes great. It's a good size bowl. And uh, it's a workhorse of a pipe. So I'll be smoking out of that. And for my non-briar pipe, we're doing a cob by Missouri Meerschaum. Now this may not look like a cob, but this is their classic country gentleman. Probably my favorite cob shape. But it's in that black, what they call Dark Knight finish or Dark Knight series. Again, another great smoking pipe. Packs easy, lights easy. And just to show you, Missouri Meerschaum. So that's what I'm going to be smoking. I'll be doing maybe share pipes or follow-up videos throughout the month as I'm smoking these. Maybe we'll see if we get much of a difference in taste. With the same tobacco between the briar and the cob. We'll see if maybe the flavor changes for me over the month. Anyways, exciting challenge. I think I kind of maybe tried doing it last year. Uh, slightly different rules, but I think the hard part's going to be smoking the one tobacco. Because for me, variety is the spice of life. And I love trying different tobaccos. So thanks for joining me along for the ride if you're doing it. Let me know. Like I said, I'll have his video posted down below. Go check it out if you have any other questions. I also know he had a rules clarification video that posted up recently. Haven't watched that. I'll be doing that while I'll be smoking the cob. So there you go. Hope you have a great day. Hope it continues to go well for you. And as always, thanks for watching. God bless. And we'll see you soon.